Hello and welcome back to the tomb of St. Tenor. We've just come here into the Brennan family tomb. Oh, hello. Which is clearly trapped to steal Lady Brennan's amethyst medallion. Actually, you know what? Let's leave the door open in case we need to get out in a hurry. Yeah, it's probably going to be misleading us, right? There's going to be more dangerous traps than just this, surely. I mean, that's a trap, very clearly. Oh, hello. Oh, we can turn that. Oh, I see. It's shooting and it goes right through, I see. Nice, that's, that's a nice little uh, touch. Oh, okay, we need it coming in here to uh, get it through all these. So it's not a, just a trap, it's a puzzle. Okay. if we get it in there actually like I see that's got a receptacle this one doesn't how do we get it in there feels like there's a secret You clever son of a bitch. That's empty. All right. Do we need more? Yeah, we're gonna need we're gonna need it back through there as well. Okay, let's put this back the way it was. Whoa! Careful. Another receptacle there. Okay, let's let's try and get these happening. All right, it comes in here. That was a problem. Okay, it comes in there. Out here. That one's alright. That one's alright. That one needs to send it. Is it a pass through? All right, I'll send it to here. We'll send it to here, which will send it in there. All right, so just turn this one on. This one didn't have a receptacle right now. All right, so how do we make this one work? Way I need it to get out of here. I right, just need to change this one. All right, let's. Let's just leave that dead there, so we can look in here with relative relative safety. None of these have receptacles then. So I mean they're actually all just walls. I suppose technically this is kind of an exploit. You know, just hitting things to see if they go clunk. I mean it's abusing abusing 
game mechanics, right? You can easily tell the difference between a, a door and a wall. But it's a useful thing to be able to know. Garrett, that's just Garrett's, you know, he's an expert at finding secrets and traps, and just one of the tools he uses to do it is his blackjack. All right. That's going to come in here. It's going to send it... Uh, we've got to get out this door, right? Let's go back. Let's go backwards. So that is a pass-through, so it's going to go straight. That's also a pass-through, so it's going to go straight. That turns. Can I send it down here or up to that one? Well, that looks like it should work. Then what are all these extra ones for? That's suspicious. Why is there a lot more pieces than I need? Oh, because we don't shoot into his mouth. Oh, hang on, let me just stop this so I can go around the outside. Okay. We don't shoot into his mouth. That's the answer why there's so many more. Where do we shoot it? Where is the... Uh... Hmm. Oh, what? Hang on. Let me stop it again. Up there. Oh, right, so it needs to come into this one. And we can turn this one any which way, all right. So the door was the red herring. So we come in here. You're a right turn. Send it to you. Send it to your pass through. You're a right turn. Send it to you. You come here. Pass through. Right turn, right turn, pass through you, to here, and I'll get up. And then this one's just meaningless. All the rest are used, okay. God, this thing fires so often, it's just so rapidly. Yeah, all right. Uh, but we also need to now get it through the door. Alright, let's... Let's just make it face the wall. Alright, I'll be out of my way. So now I do need to get it through the door in order to get it into this receptacle. So this one's got two solutions, that's good. So my whole question of why does this seem so easy is because there's two answers. Alright, before I do that, let us see what awaits us in this room. I mean, you look like you're a trap, although you have a, a receptacle on both, a, a bit on both sides. So maybe that's actually a door, and this will get it through. Let's try it. Yep. Well, I can't safely rotate that one, right? To switch it off, let's switch it off there. All right, there's a, a secret door. The leg bone, and that is the uh, gem we needed, the amethyst. So there's a whole other room here. Is this a trap? Or is that just a way out? I guess that's just a way out. It's the answer of how the Brennan family... Yeah, okay. Well, let's just close these doors then. Alright, Brennan's family... Gems are done. 
You know what? It wouldn't be too it wouldn't be a good idea to leave this place open for any other future treasure hunters to just get in here so easily. Let's make them have to fight for it. Just there's a tiny little bit sticking out there. I don't know what it is. Uh alright. Brennan's done. I guess we keep going up on this upper upper level. I should go in there. Let's see where this takes me. Oh, this is just where I... Okay, that's just where I slotted the guy, which means... I've been through here already? I guess... Have I explored this entire upper level, then? I mean, I could do things like, you know, are you real or are you not? But it's a little tedious to do that everywhere. If I see signs that something looks like a fake door... Then I'll... Then I'll do something with it, but until I see such signs, I'll leave the line right. You're walking back and forth. Alright, so we've got stairs there. How do I get there? I mean, I could jump down there. I suppose. <laughs> there because I came out there and jumped onto that and that was this so we're looking into this room I guess maybe I haven't been in there I went past the door and there were three zombies in there hello don't mind me when I have all this equipment I'm not really using any of it right <laughs> But that's the way of it, you know. Being a master thief isn't about spending all the equipment you have, it's about you spending it when it's useful to spend it. When it's necessary and not before. Oh, that's just the main stair. Okay. Healing version. No traps. No traps. Wow. Right, so I haven't been, like, down to the lower levels at all, have I? I don't know. I feel like there's a place up here I still haven't explored. Which was... Whoop, down there where that haunt is coming from. Oh shit, I'm sitting in bright light. I did come that way before. Because I looked in here when there were three zombies in here. Wait, where else? Let's have, let's just scout from here. Not, not climb ladders unnecessarily. Oh, well, there's something up there. Looks like nothing on top of that one. Hard to say. Oh well, I can avoid climbing ladders, that's good. Anything on any of these lower ones? something up there or is that just the texture? Just the texture. Alright. 
Where are you going, Mr. Breathing Man? I don't really care about the answer to that question. Where am I going as a question? South. been here? I don't recall now. Oh, hello. The Alaris. Uh, the Alaris tomb's always collapsed. Some calamity happened there. Alright, so we've done Midas, we've done Brennan. We just have all this to do, which is uh, on the eastern side, which is where we're going now. I suppose. For lack of a better plan, although he might be on the ground floor, I don't know. It's like, there's two floors down there that I've yet to explore. And then we still have, after that, the High Priest of the Saints, so... Uh... Oh, wait, have I been here? Well, I guess not. <laughs> Ah, right, I came in across there and I saw this wooden platform, but didn't come this way. Well, let's try going down here and see where it takes us. Which way? Uh, east? Okay, now, I've been on the top of this, but not at this level. This is... Here, it means we've missed the Wallace Tomb already. Wallace Tomb is through, through there to the north. So this will get us down to the ground floor. But before I go down there, let's keep exploring this level. Anything up the top? Let's keep exploring this level. What well, that is all of this level at this area? Well, alright, done. There's more of this level over here, though. Including dangerous ladders. My favorite kind of ladder. Wait, I don't need to go up the same ladder on the other side of the same tombs, I just want to just go up to this one. Like, these ladders are reasonably safe if I don't get off them, but if I climb, try to climb onto the tomb, then it's going to be hard to get back onto the ladder I'll hurt myself again, most likely. Ah, yes. You thought you saw something, but there was nothing there. Right, have I been... Uh, was that a rope? So I've been in this room, right? Because I remember seeing the leg there, but I went out that way, not this way. And through here... I think you can see a rope hanging down, which surely I didn't put there. <laughs> oh, it's a chandelier. And lots of stairs down. Is that is that just this stairway again? No. Where at this kind of northern end? Well, maybe it is. Uh, this maybe is this the entry stairs then, and this is the stairs to the next area. Maybe, maybe. All right. Um, well, then the Wallace tomb should be the east of here, right? This should be the way to the Wallace tomb. Yes. Good. Wallace. What did you have for us? So let's keep the doors open again in case I need to make a quick getaway, but. Uh, You have a zombie. You have another zombie. You have a stairway. I guess we take the stairs. No, you saw nothing.
I'm gonna do it with lots of holy water, right? I've got 18 water arrows. <clears throat> and uh, five vials for holy water. I could absolutely just gather these people together and people like them awesome. And slaughter them if I wished. But if all they've got to scare me off is zombies, then... You know, then I'm not really very threatened. Hello, the bugs. The bugs are more of a threat. <laughs> Oh, part of it's underwater, okay. I guess we, uh, go onward and downward. Through the wall. Wait a second, is there two stairways here? There's a hidden stairway there. Is there? So there is, there's a double helix. That's very nice. I was down there before. Very clever. Hello, is that a... A wooden beam. That's a wooden beam. Conveniently positioned for me to look up and when I didn't look up. Still, I do like this double, double helix stairway that hides... Hides one stairway underneath the other. are nice. Guess nobody's breathed that air in like a hundred years. Is there anything here? No. What about this power bounce? Always worth checking. Okay. Let's get back to the air pocket, and then we'll continue on down the hallway. <laughs> okay, I guess that's gonna be important. I should do it like a Freeman's Mind thing where I'm just like, start talking in a underwater voice, but you know, set up some filters so it sounds like I'm underwater for when I talk when I'm swimming. That would be uh, entertaining, but it would need some more... Oh, shh. Well, okay, it's not that bad, I don't need to... So that was a, a thought, like, it's not trapped. Surely there's no trap there. And it was trapped. Oh, it hides more stairs, okay. And this is just... connects here, right, so it's not... That's a pretty lame trap, you know, but I guess... I guess if the roof hadn't collapsed, it would have been more... more successful trap. Alright, so this is just going to take us up. Quiet, you. Alright, oh, you guys hearing me. Is this the, proper, the actual main part of the tomb now? At the top floor? I, I... I wish I had built that staircase. That's my favourite piece of this mission so far, is that... The double staircase. Oh, 
Bug zombie. Uh... Alright, they both go around here. Check. So he did see me and went to hunt, but uh, it doesn't matter. What is all this stuff for if not to be used? Is that a trap? Feels like a trap, you know? There's a sword. Well, maybe it's not a trap. Maybe the real trap was just the zombies. And here we are. So I guess we went in. Oh, we came out just here. Right, so we went in there and went around and came out. Okie dokie, so bottom floor is where I need to be. So unlike the Bone Horde, this doesn't really have loads of fireball traps, well, doesn't have any fireball traps that we can lead the zombies in front of for uh, entertaining explosions. But you have 11 fire arrows. Right? You didn't see anything. I could quite handily uh, take out a lot of zombies that way if I needed to. Alright, it's a hammer above that doorway. Let's just kind of go east to west. Have I been in here? Looks vaguely familiar. Although I don't think I went down these stairs. There's another floor, alright. Let's This. Oh, it's the Midas tomb. Okay, so I've been in there. So, right, I'm coming, I'm coming around these, this floor here, kind of area. I'm, I'm so lost, I could turn around so easily in here. It's just so few landmarks. this room. So is that where I came in? I don't know, I don't recall. Just keep wandering until I feel like I've wandered all of it. Bearing in mind, there is at least one more floor below, which is probably where we get to this main staircase from. Oh, hello. Sorry, I didn't mean to run into you there. Oh, look, they're everywhere. 
Okay, I was just here. I remember that uh, skull and pool of blood. Honestly, we should leave these fellas be. Let's head around to the north now. God, three of you in here. And this is... I don't know, this... One of these rooms? We can go... Southeast? Or west from it? Must be this one. It's way up. Not after way up at the moment. Have I been in here? I don't believe so, but it doesn't look like there's any loot. Alright, nothing there. Gosh, look at them all. I don't even need to thin the herd. Well, I guess as long as they're... As long as they're not causing anyone any trouble, it's... You know, they've got a right to... To live, same as anyone else, right? If you can call this life. So was there anything down here except... Him? No, I guess not. Oh, let's say that's a dead end, but it does actually have... Oh, right, I've been up there. I've been up across there. All right, so this is east-west passages through here. Right, there's stairs up, but I don't need stairs up. This is exit to the east and southwest and southeast, which is this one. So if we go out the southeast exit, that will actually take us somewhere useful. Uh, then we go to the north out of here. Should take us the stairs down. All right, so stairs down to the main stairs. As we head towards the high priest. We got at least two, we got all three. Oh, I like how it marks the third one optional after you've already done two of them, that's good. Just go and find where these high priests and, uh, what is it, high priests map? High priests and saints, it's a very small area. We come out the stairs, I'll have two long hallways and some stairways up or down. I mean, we're going down a very long way here. This is a surprise. This pillar is intact. You know, there's an enormous uh, pressure on that. I mean, just from its own weight, it would have enormous pressure. Yeah, stop with the spooky sound effects when I'm trying to go down. All right, there's a high priest zombie. Side. Okay, so what looks like two passages is two walkways over a very large tomb indeed. I'm just gonna let this guy wander past me. So then I can uh, stay behind him and avoid unnecessarily uh, confusing him with my presence. Uh. Oh, hello. You, I do not want here. I'm waiting was a good plan then. All 
Alright, you go hunt for me there. I'm gonna make some progress out here. Hello. Oh god, how am I gonna do these? This does not feel safe. It was not safe, and there's more hammers down there. You know what? I'm gonna come back for those. Unless, unless, I mean, this is this is Monkey Arms Garret, right? Can I reach it from here? No, I do. I would need to jump. And I can kind of make the jump, but kind of not. I wonder how you're supposed to get those. Is that? Nope, not like that. All right, well. Make a mental note. Let's make a physical note. And save so I don't lose the note. All right. We've got a zombie wandering around that level, which is fine. He's not gonna bother us. What have we got down here? I heard another haunt when I fell down and died before. And I did hear another zombie from up above. I heard another haunt just then. Jingling chains. I mean, I could put out these torches, right? I've got a zombie on this level. Zombie on down there. I guess there's a haunt down below. This fella's probably going to come all the way across and just be kind of annoying, so... Let's take these candles. And wait for this... fine, upstanding... shambler to shamble past. see? Did you notice the missing candles? Or what? Well, something spooked him. Well, I don't need to worry about what. Where am I hearing that haunt? I don't know, but I don't like it when I can hear a haunt and not see it. about hearing a horn and not seeing it? <laughs> no, all the zombies are working out. But they don't bother me over much. them but not fret. God I remember when I used to be absolutely terrified of the zombies. I, I kind of find them cute now rather than scary. Well, it's, it's not, not really how they're uh, supposed to be perceived. Hello. This doesn't look ominous at all. <laughs> Hello. 
All right, you've seen me now, guys. Just don't worry your little brains about it too much. All right, those zombies out there will soon forget me. I'll just say. Be gone to those who would steal from this place, lest ye face the wrath of the Builder. And in warning... Are you guys actually coming here? Do I have to deploy holy water on you or something? Surely not. If you come in here and bother me, I will have to. All right, well, no, I'll just lead him over here. That's fine. Lead him up here and then lose him. Come on, guys. Wait, was that? Was that loot? No, this is zombie leg. Look how quickly they forget that I'm here. I'm here guys, I'm here. Man, you guys are dumb. Right, so he died. Picking up this thing. Somehow. Oh god, they're coming here too? <laughs> Alright, uh, I died too. Before or after I got the diamond, I think after, yeah. Alright, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wait for these guys to calm down. Look at them, moving in sync. Maybe wasted with a noise maker. Where, where did it even go? Where did my arrow go? I kind of shot it out here. I mean, I don't like to leave evidence behind, right? Where's. Where did it go? guys you're just getting annoying now I have this death trap maze to navigate and you're not making it easier on me because I need to not rush I need to look at pay attention to the signs All right, let's make sure block line of sight sit in the dark that should uh, put them off the sand Uh, gone back to just wandering. Oh, the other guy sounds like he's searching still. Oh, not. I guess they're both satisfied that 
It was just rats after all. Alright, let's just go see where this guy turns. Just make sure he won't see me coming in here. Alright, so. This is a death trap. And I don't know how I'm supposed to know. But I went down this way. And one of these sections killed me. I think it was the next but one. Um, well, I'm safe here, right? This one doesn't kill me. Does this one kill me? How can I tell? Do any of the statues look different? Wait, 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 yes, look. Those statues have skulls for faces. These ones don't. Alright. Okay. Skulls. 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 So that's the dead end. Okay, I can do this. Not skulls. Skulls and skulls, but not, not skulls. More skulls either way. So if I'd just gone straight from the entrance, I would have died right away. I just happened to turn left because, you know, the straight path is always suspicious. Alright, that's death, that's death. This is not death. And if I turned right instead of left, I would have also met my end. Okay. It's good because, like, this, the bodies look almost the same. It's very hard to tell. It's just the faces. It's, uh... Only clear, so it's death ahead, so I come this way. Death to the left of me. Okay, so now I actually have a choice of pa passages. This is not death, and that's not death. That's death, so this is not. Oh, there's uh, heavy machinery up ahead. Another trap, I guess. Okay. So here's my question. That gets me through. If I go back to where I just came from, where I had the choice of two passages, which was here, where would this one have taken me? There's death to the left of me, but it's not death here. It's not death here. Aha! Always worth uh, exploring. I almost ran straight through there, but was oh, the wrong passage. This is the one I go straight through. Alright. Ah! Hammerite tombs, huh? Is these the hammers I'm supposed to steal? No, so what's with the deal with the water? No, I can just... Fall in and come back out again here, I guess. I do have a speed potion, maybe I should use it. I'm not sure it'll help me, it's uh, probably going to go too fast and harder to predict. Oops. Now why couldn't they have just put these ladders at the other end of the pool, you know? Let's try that again. At least these aren't insta-death. I'm just not quite sure how big the hitboxes are. You 
got a speed potion is probably gonna be useful right now. Just for that jump alone. Okay, uh a healing potion, that's that's generous. Another room of death. Is this slippery? It is slippery. Zombies down below, thin breaking bits of bits of break, I guess. Can I get up there? Not from this side. Oh, I can't jump on this. Okay, so maybe the thin bits don't break, because if they break, then there's no way across here. Just careful. Can I mantle up there? Or is that just a way down? Yeah, so mantling is possible. Does that help me? Where do I need to get to? There's a door. Doesn't, that's the way I came in. Alright, I can get higher up from this direction. Oh yeah, the ramps and stuff are all broken up there, so the mantling was the right way to go. Okay. So far so good. Although maybe the ramps would have worked all right. I don't know. Uh, it kind of would have been hard with that gap there. But it might have worked. Well. All right. St. Tenor, but before we go to St. Tenor's place... Uh, oh, I guess I'm not really getting back to that loot I missed on the upper floors, am I? What have we got here? It looks like a sealed doorway. Unless this is a, unless this is a way out. Let's just take us. Oh, this is the upper level after all. Okay, it's not. It's not like another way out of the entire place, which is a problem. So how do we get that? Is it? Is it just a jump? Am I supposed to mantle on top and then jump back? Yeah, I think I am. Okay. Okay, that's not too bad. Let's see if there's any on the other side. Oh. Take your time behind zombie bug man here. Says loot. Oh god, you're so noisy, man. So let's stay further back, just keep the noise down. Keep thinking I see loot in the distance, it's just a speck of dust on my screen. Aha, here we go. Right, well, this one makes it easier to get to, and presumably easier to get back. Good enough. Alright, 
to St. Jenna's, which has got to have another trap, right? It's not... We haven't seen the end of the traps yet. To St. Jenna's actual tomb. Are you a doorway by any chance? Oh, you're not. I have no idea how we're going to find another way out of here, but I guess I press on and worry about that bit last. It's possible that this is a way out. Yeah, there's got to be a way out somehow. Alright, well, I guess we'll find out how. What have we got there? A barrack. <laughs> it's like, what is that thing? It's a barrack. It's just a barrack. Oh, hello. Barracks have, like, completely eaten this place up. Oh, there's more of them. Alright, well, problem is... Where's he going? If I rush forward and knock this guy out, which I can probably do, then this guy would come and see his body and raise the alarm, so... I do need to be careful. He's, he's riled up, unfortunately. I was hoping to just like sneak behind him, but nope, the death cry, well, unconsciousness cry. Got him kind of riled up there. Well, let's wait for him to calm down. It won't take long. We don't... As a member of the Barrack Preservation Society... Whoops, no. He was still quite alert. Alright, well, let's go this way. we go down. You know, that's the answer when you're... Whoops. When you're trying to find another way out of a really deep tomb is... Uh, when you're in a pit, keep digging. More barracks then. Go south. Hello. Go north. Oh, there's more of them. Let's see what's north here. Here, watching this direction, see. Well, let's try the other northern tunnel then. Wait, is this a tunnel? No, it's dead. End. That's why I knocked out. <laughs> Unfortunately, he's not quite in the darkness there. Actually, let's check out the southern tunnels. Why not? Someone was here. Someone was like digested there, I guess I don't 
So all this equipment, you know, that I went to the trouble of uh, gathering and uh, not even using any of it. All right, well, he's... Oh, we'll go this way. Right. So we keep going north there, we can come... Whoa! Alright, big barrack uh, chamber they've dug out here. Now what's, what's out this way? Probably just passages connecting down there. Yes. Is that what I was looking at? Yeah, because I could see that hole. So there's a hole in the southeast corner. It's very hard to see. There's a underwater tunnel which might be the way out I'm guessing it doesn't look like it's it does look like it goes somewhere oh is there a passage up there as well I can barely see a thing let me just try a rope arrow Turn. So this would be the, the hole I saw, the other hole I saw, right? Yeah. Which just gives me another gas arrow. And a breath potion, that might be necessary. I guess, I guess there's some logic here that, you know, the, the poison gas that the barracks breathe out is collecting in little nooks and crannies and that's the gas crystals that I'm finding for these gas arrows. Alright, well, you know, to escape from this really deep pit we've come in, let's keep going down. Eventually we'll come out the other side, right? Right? Or, oh dear, we've got choice of passages now. Let's go left. I hope not to run out of air too soon. You know what? There's loot. Where there's loot, there's Garrett's death. Why is it giving us water arrows now? What are we going to encounter on the way out of here that we need all these water arrows for? Oh, thank goodness. Well, I guess the breath potion or maybe the speed potion was necessary there. Seems too long. I guess taking damage and healing would be a possibility too. Oh, we're in the lost city. Well, now I know what the water arrows are for. New objectives. Uh, a precursor settlement, see if you can find anything valuable. Missed. I would normally reload there, but you know, I'm being good. I'm trying to avoid saves coming. So I won't. Does this take me anywhere? Well, I'm not going through that room. Oh wow, this place is enormous. It's 
There might be a way out up there. Hello, what have we got here? You see a pitch dark room, but thankfully they've got automatic lights. Helps me to see the loot, you know? So I don't know if that can be opened or not. really didn't help all that much, right? It didn't show us the way through the barrack tunnels, doesn't show us the way through here. Alright, that's one gone. Not that it's entirely necessary, but it's, uh, don't get stuck, Garrett. It's certainly, uh, oops. Helpful. All right, down back down to 15 more arrows. So I guess all the ones I picked up in while swimming, I wasted or used. That's right. I can wander around a little more safely now. Obviously, something important's up there, but let's explore the ground level first before I head up that way. Oh, hey, side entrance. Okay. Where's the other edge of this river go? Is this... It goes somewhere, okay. There's a current. Uh, if I go in here, I probably can't come back. Alright. We have a raft. Our boat arrived at the Sky Temple today. I feel very lucky. Not many people from Karath didn't get to visit this place. I hope we will be allowed to see the Sky Gem soon. Well, this is my way out. I hope it's a short ride. All right, last well, way out. Good to know. Uh, and that's on the eastern side. Where does this passage go? Or is this what he means? Is this his way out? No, because it's, I hope it's a short ride, is there? Raft. So. What's in these passages? Cause this is like going, what? This is more territory. What the hell? I guess we're not going up by, by raft, then it's this whole precursor settlement just a dead end. Well, I guess we'll come back to the more part and um, see where it takes us after we're done in here. Oh, hello. No, 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 you don't want to come and bother me. still got nine left. I'm wasting them, but it doesn't really matter. Right, anything around the back here? There's a window. Broadheads. Blocked off ladder. Alright, that's right, because you can kill them with broadheads, in fact. They fire... Things. Ladder. I'm just heading back south, which feels like back to the moor area, right? So let's stay out of there for now. That's the ladder I came up. 
That's the one that was blocked. Okay, there's a roof I can get on. Let's get onto the roof. Something about this ladder feels very counter-strike. <laughs> Anything on this roof? Anything on that roof? Oh! Ouch! Ah, whatever. I'll take it. Oh, the ceiling. Uh, the sky temple, the sky gem, right? We want the sky gem. It sounds like a gem. It sounds like something we should have. How many of these other buildings are actually accessible? Passageway? Oh, this is where I came in. I guess. Is it? Feels further north. Oh no. I guess this is I guess this is in fact where I came in. Can I check out this room? That's the way out, right. That's the raft. Well, actually, this is where he says is the way out, but I'm not convinced it will be. Okay, let's go to the big, the big place. Just me checking these room, these doors. Anyway, inside, there doesn't look like it. Unless this place has a doorway on this side. Or an open window. No, whoops. Alright. Enough dilly dallying. We need to go into the sky temple, right? But this is a really good place to end the episode. So thanks very much for watching, and I hope you'll join me here for the next episode when we go to see if we can get this famed sky gem.